Hey guys, I'm Rayhana and in this video I'm gonna show you how to uh, create a button navigation in your Android project. Okay, let's start. Here uh, I have a new project and uh, first of all I want to add view binding in my project okay okay sync it synced uh, without problem and then I want to add three fragments Okay, first fragment, second fragment, and the last one, third fragment. Uh, and also I want to delete this code because I don't need them okay for second activity as well and also for the last activity sorry the last fragment okay okay now uh, I need add something in my main activity before that before that let me to add navigation because I need navigation to uh, set my start destination and also in the last step of this project, I should uh, set my navigation for my button navigation. Okay, so here, resource type, I should choose navigation, and here, uh, and I need just say something. Um, in Gradle file, I didn't add uh, my dependency about navigation. Is not problem now because uh, here I click an OK button uh, it's added automatically you can see here my dependency here you can see yes OK and add it in sync project yes and here just I need to add my fragments and uh, if you like to know about uh, navigation or navigation component uh, you can see my video about navigation components and uh, here you can see the first fragment is my a start destination this icon means uh, this activity is my start destination for the navigation let's to add some code in my main activity okay here and also here okay is great here I need add some code first of all um, I need some this one and then I should add my bottom navigation code and here uh, I need to create a menu for my uh, each option of my bottom navigation okay for creating menu uh, you can just need click uh, right click on the res new 
here and choose minnow and here uh, I put this name you can add everything what you want and in this part I added my item for saving time and paste my code and uh, I need just uh, some icon so I can change it this one because let me add some vector asset here yes I need number asset yeah it's my first fragment the another one for my second fragment yes here and the last one for my third fragment here okay now I can filter one, two, and three. And here I can, yeah, you can see the error is gone. And also, I want to add some changes uh, changes to my UI. Uh, a fragment add some color code here and set it on to my fragment okay here I want to set gravity for my text view and put it there first yes and here I can set text color it can be blue it's maybe better here and I want to set background here yes also I can do something like that uh, let me check my color code uh, here is this code is better yeah this one is better and actually I do the same thing for my second fragment takes a style bold gravity center text text color it can be red yes it can be red and also the string and it it can be changed okay and also I want to set background red 100 yes and as well I do that for my last fragment background I guess yes I have green and here I can put something like that text color green yeah text the style bold and also sets gravity okay everything is ready and now I just need to do last step I want to add a uh, binding here Yes, this one and here binding. Okay. 
Yes. Okay. And now, first of all, I need to have um, a variable for my nav controller private latinate var nav controller yes this one okay here uh, after I create my variable I need write this code that find navigation this activity and here I should pass this one. Yeah. And then Set up with nav controller. Okay, yes. I need imported, yes. Okay, and here I passed one thing my bottom navigation and also this variable. You know. In this variable has uh, my navigation host all of things related to my navigation and here I set my bottom navigation with this okay I try to run it and maybe if take a long time so I pause recording and when my application is run. I recording again and show you. Okay, our program you can see it's run and works very well. But I uh, need to say something so important, uh, and it's about the ID, the ID in to this file. Uh, your menu item. And actually, in your uh, navigation file, please remember, this ID for each item should be same. I mean, here you have a fragment for first fragment, for example. And here, in your menu, you have item related to that fragment it should be same ID and as well for other item if uh, if it doesn't have same ID it doesn't work I mean when you click here doesn't change and just that uh, thank you so much for watching my video. Please like and subscribe to my channel and pre press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you.